All right, so today we're gonna be doing some trout fishing. I'm just packing all the stuff right now. Oh, we only have like three hours. We're going out to one of our spots. It's only a little pond and it's had two tournaments and people there fishing all throughout the week. So we're gonna go to one of our spots that we normally catch our fish. If that doesn't work out, we're gonna move around and try a new spot. So we'll see, we're gonna get out there and hopefully we'll catch a few fish. super deep right here but we don't want it to be super deep all right I'm gonna go get some traps out and hopefully get a few fish all right we have all our traps out, eight traps set up on this whole shoreline. Usually this place is pretty good for, for jigging, but hopefully we'll catch a few fish. This place has had two tournaments on it and it's only a small little pond, so people fish us a lot, so we'll see. But hopefully we can end up with a few fish. We got this whole shoreline full of traps, so 2.30 right now. We might be here up till dark, we might not, I don't know. It's pretty windy. But hopefully we can get a few trucks tonight. I just changed this one too. Is to... he still on there? I don't think so. The fish is still there, just leave it. I reeled this one up. Could have been the minnow. Or a wind flag. Get him. Nice. Yeah, uh, okay, but not big. Bring it up. Bring it up. I am. <laughs> I saw that. At the bottom. Uh, Did you just check this trout? Uh, yeah, I just put it back there. How far down is it? Like two feet up the bottom. But I put it down farther. Going? Yeah. Oh yeah, it's way off. Oh, here we go, there we go. There we go. Oh, I saw it spinning. Yeah. And you're going. Got him. Yes, yes, yes. Please be a trout, please be a trout. <laughs> well. There he goes. Huh. Catch and pick, roam but no trout. All right, we got an hour left of daylight. The guys across the pond moved, so we're gonna go over there. We found a couple of their holes that had blood in it, so we're gonna move like three traps over there and jig. Maybe we'll get a last minute trout. Who knows? But this side has been pressured, so a lot. Hopefully, we catch a few fish. How deep down are you? Uh, more than I thought I was going to be. Probably two feet below the ice. Three feet. Even. Right here. He took it. We should we get one over here, Jack. We should get some live bait, though. Hey, buddy, back, back. You yours? Can, could you see it? There he goes. Got him. That's a good one, huh? Yeah, we got one. Oh, it came off at the hole. Ah. Woo! Wait, did it break my line? Nope. Yeah, didn't it? <laughs> got oh, him. How is he dead? That's that baby. He's small. Sweet. Is that the one? Yeah. Oh, keep going. Need another minnow. Well, there you go. 
that was worth the move. Yeah. I just set that one. Get him. Oh yeah. Keep going. Got, got him. Got him. Got him. It's a nice one, isn't it? No, I don't think so. I think I'm it's not. just a crazy one. You don't hold. Not, not huge, but nice. You don't have a minnow on that trout. Sweet. Well, you're limited. All right. Well, we only ended up catching those three because we made, we came over here like only like a half hour ago. We caught three over here, which is good. But I think end of the year, there's been a lot of people in this spot and fishing, so we probably could have gone down this bank and limited out today, but it's probably going to be one of the last times we're out ice fishing because we're going to have open water soon. But yeah, pretty good day. Three trout, two pickerel. We're going to get packed out. And open water is going to be coming soon. We still have a whole bunch of ice fishing videos back it up. That'll be coming out before that, but yeah, it was a good day. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.